I remember just seeing them all the time, like, who are those guys? They are an anomaly. I don't feel like they purposely have been trying to be mysterious, right? They don't really look like a band. They do just like people who've been sort of let out for a day. What's going on? Oh, my God. It's insane, but it's fantastic. They would make really good Muppets. You have this snaky lead singer, you know, something for the ladies. Then you've got Adolf Hitler on, on the keyboards. It is a little strange. Why has that bloke got a Hitler moustache? That's a good look. Dean Martin was hanging out, and he would always, like, look at Ron like, what the... When I first discovered Sparks, I never thought of them as being American at all. I thought of them just being as, like, Sparks. They're otherworldly. I always thought Sparks were a, a British band. They're the best uh, British group ever to come out of America. Just sweet American. They are a total enigma to me. They are a band who you can look up on Wikipedia and know nothing. Who the fuck are these guys? Ron has a huge snow globe collection. I'm like, oh, really? It's quite special and um, odd. If you try to describe them to people, it's like, what do they sound like? Sparks. The work speaks for itself, so I don't have to know them. All pop music is rearranged Vince Clark and rearranged Sparks. That's the truth. So we have influenced everyone. <laughs> Honestly, I don't want to see this movie. I don't want to learn too much about them. Um, I'll watch it because I'm in it. What do you think about me calling the documentary The Sparks Brothers? <laughs> uh, in lieu of anything better. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We hate that name. <laughs>